Uh, breaking news uh, coming in at this point. Uh, Vinesh Pogart's decision uh, is, to, is now going to come by 9.30 p.m. Indian Standard Time. Uh, the IOC uh, Vinesh uh, versus uh, the United World uh, Wrestling decision uh, is on uh, Pogart's silver medal. Remember, uh, Vinesh Pogart who had a tremendous campaign at the Paris Olympics where she went on to beat uh, uh, the world champion as well as the defending Olympic champion uh, in her first round uh, uh, followed followed it up with the European uh, champion uh, defeating the European champion Oksana Livach and then defeating uh, the Pan American champion Guzman in uh, that semi final bout. Uh, she had uh, reached the final uh, first for uh, any Indian woman wrestler uh, to have reached uh, the final of. Uh, 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 of uh, a wrestling uh, event in uh, at the Olympics, and uh, for now, uh, what we are learning at the moment is uh, uh, the time for tribunal's uh, decision has been extended. Vinesh Bogat's uh, appeal, uh, uh, the time for that tribunal's decision has been extended. That decision is likely to come at uh, come by 9:30 p.m. Indian Standard Time today. It was, uh, it was a heartbreak for uh, the Indian champion Vinesh Pogart after uh, she was disqualified for being just over 100 grams uh, uh, before uh, the vein uh, on the day of her final bout. Uh, remember the Court of Arbitration for Sports uh, is, uh, was hearing uh, uh, the Indian wrestler Vinesh Pogart's plea against her disqualification at the Paris Olympics. Uh, in her appeal, uh, Vinesh Pogart, she had requested uh, for a joint silver as she was found uh, 100 grams overweight after she won the semi-final uh, bout uh, against Guzman at Paris. Now, in a major development uh, in that particular case, uh, Vinesh Pogar's court hearing uh, uh, is, uh, has, uh, it's, uh, uh, the case has been concluded and the decision is likely to be announced uh, today at 9.30 uh, p.m. Indian Standard Time. And Rika joins us live uh, from Paris uh, to get us more on this. Rika, what are the latest updates? Uh, what more can you tell us? Well, uh, uh, this is a press release that we have got from the tribunal that uh, the decision will be announced on or before 6 p.m. Paris time or 9.30 p.m. India time. Uh, today, uh, the case was heard at uh, a, a tribunal uh, as tribunal uh, yesterday uh, and uh, I can tell you that four French lawyers appeared for Vinesh Fogart and uh, uh, the, the, these uh, lawyers were appearing pro bono for the athlete and uh, there was of course uh, the, there were of course friends of the court uh, Harish Salve and Vidushpat Singhania representing the Indian Olympic Association they are also a party to this case they argued that Vinesh Fogart um, well, she had not done anything intentionally. There was no malicious intent. She had tried everything in her books to manage the weight. The weight could not be managed, and hence uh, uh, she could not. She was disqualified, and the disqualification in itself is not uh, right. She should have been allowed to fight. Uh, the, most of the appeal was made on emotional grounds that uh, you know that she she tried everything in her books to manage her weight, but was unable to do so. Hence, she should be awarded a joint silver. Absolutely, Rika. And in fact, uh, the Indian Olympic Association, it has also remained very hopeful uh, of a positive resolution for uh, the wrestler's uh, application before that ad hoc uh, uh, division of the Court of Arbitration for Sports. Uh, what is uh, What can uh, uh, the, I, the IOC, uh, IOA expect from... Uh, uh, the court and uh, what what can be like uh, what can be the positive uh, uh, likelihood from uh, this particular uh, hearing that uh, uh, that you are mentioning right now? Uh, Osama, there are clear cut. Clear, it's a clear cut case of a, a positive or a negative decision. Positive decision has to be awarding a silver medal to Vinesh Fogart. Neg negative decision would be no medal for her. But, you know, the case is uh, led. There have been a uh, heavy lobby for uh, Vinesh Fogart uh, by, you know, various agencies, uh, even private players uh, getting involved in this uh, um, and, 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 you know, getting in someone as a heavyweight, a lawyer, 
as Harish Salve to appear for Indian Olympic Association. There have been private funders who've been backing uh, backing IOA uh, to win this case for Vinesh Pogart. It is uh, a lot of prestige of India at stake. Remember, we stand at six medals right now. Uh, if this happens, if, if a silver comes our way, then it will be the seventh right. medal for India. Uh, well, the hopes, I would right. say, are very slim because we were speaking to uh, the uh, head of UWW yesterday and he said that if the court, um, you know, asks us to grant the silver, in, in no event, there are two medals, basically. Right. So if right. the court uh, then grant the silver, it'll be, it'll be exceptional. Then IOC, A, IOC has to look okay. into it. B, it would also be a case of UWW having to change competition rules. Competition rules are never Absolutely. changed while a competition is on. So whatever changes Osama happens in the competition rules, if the court suggests will happen after the Olympic Games, it will be for the next four years cycle. It cannot happen in the middle of a competition. Absolutely. But, in, fact, know, uh, happens, uh, in fact, in uh, fact, what uh, what the Indian Olympic Association also said that uh, it was in fact its duty to back Vinesh, and that is what uh, they have done. Uh, that decision is expected by 9:30 p.m. Indian Standard Time.